Alright, it's time for episode 2 of knocking out every single NPC in Bangkok and piling their bodies up in Hitman's bedroom. I'm gonna take care of the atrium roof real quick, so let's -a go. Alright, that's a good time when these guards are coming over here. How did you not hear that? What are you doing? I'm just staring blankly over there. Oh. The fuck? First fucking kill and we're already getting bizarre AI behaviour. This game is fucking great. I'll wait for him to walk away and then hopefully he'll still be standing about like a twat. Come on guys, do something. Anything. Okay, finally. Wait, what? Right, come back here. Yeah, he comes over, but he doesn't seem to, like, do the investigation thing. He just stands there for no reason. Okay, now his friend's finally moving. Oh, he's coming in here? The fuck? Okay, I'll take it. Now he's all on his lonesome. So it should be able to just do a bit of this. Try and lure him further in here. Is he coming to investigate that or is he not? He is not. Come on. Come on. Yes, you heard something. I don't have a screwdriver or the knife. What happened to them? Oh, well, there's the knife. I guess the screwdriver pinged off into the ether. Right. Come over here, mate. That is the intention. Now for the second set of guards, which will be a bit trickier to get them, because, well first of all we're kind of running low on objects, so I'm going to check these rooms, actually if we go in here, I know in here, I can get a golf club and a microphone, there's a golf club. Oh, I can also get a body. Right, so hopefully I can lure him to about here. Uh -huh. Oh, there's a screwdriver. Nice. Right, come here. Oh, for fuck's sake, are they actually deaf? Come on. So you heard that. Sir, you're gonna have to cut this out right now. Certainly, sir. Is that any better, sir? Alright, let's just lure this guy over here. Alright, <clears throat> that is the atrium roof. So we'll get the manager to prop the door open for us again. And we'll drag these lovely chaps back into the suite. Moving at speed of sound, they try to kiss their tongue around. Got ourselves a situation stuck in a new. All right, we are so close to being at shoulder height. This is looking pretty good. Actually, no, I don't really need to uh, unprop the door. So now that I've dealt with the, the atrium roof, 
There's not going to be any conscious bodies coming anywhere near here anymore, so yeah, the manager can stay where she is. Awesome! Right, so I reckon we should check out the uh, the kitchen area downstairs now. Tell you what, um, maybe I could deal with these guards. I'm gonna be bringing them here. Those guys could be a problem. I don't, I'm thinking too far ahead, I think. I should just stick with the plan. I'm gonna clear the kitchen. So I've already done a few of the kitchen stuff. There's a body in there. Unfortunately, you can't take bodies out of dumps, so he will not be part of the pile. There's another body down there I can see that will not be part of the pile, but there's this enforcer chef guy who's always very annoying, so I reckon we can lure him in here. Uh, his body, I guess I'll just have to pop behind the desk. Really hope nobody sees this. Better save just in case. I think there's only three more kitchen staff to take care of, so we'll just observe their patrols for a wee bit. Or, ah, maybe what's in here? Okay, that's far too open. No way I'm hiding bodies there. Excuse me. Get out of the way, cunt. Okay, hopefully this guy is now close enough that I can lure him in here. That's a negative. I should be able to lure him to about. Okay, maybe not anymore. I'll try and lure somebody to here. Who's it gonna be? It's gonna be him. Alright. Strange. He didn't see the body. Good shit. Hey, where are you? So he's gonna look around there. Okay, I don't know where you're from, man, but that's not the way we do it here, okay? Sure. I'm sorry. Sup? Allow me to apologize with a crowbar in the back of the head. You're gonna have to turn around, mate. Oh well. There we go. So next victim. Step right up, step right up. Okay, so he's going over there, so maybe I can just without eliminating him. Oh, that guy's coming back, I think. Or is he? Now nah, we good. What? How about you show some respect? Ah, motherfucker. I'll lure this guy over here. Actually, no. I want to take him out with the coconut. See one there. It's gonna turn around there, and then get wrecked. So that guy's coming back into the kitchen. So definitely unequip the knife so there's no accidents. I don't think anybody comes through here. There are two guys in here though. Oh, more stuff. Good shit. Oh, okay, that guy just left actually. So now is probably a good time to do that. There he is. Okay. Apparently, that didn't cause unconscious witness. <laughs> I'll take it, right? I, I really don't understand what, um, you know, sometimes you can take someone out from, uh, from in front of them, and it doesn't cause unconscious witness, but most of the time it does. I do not get it. But hey, that's the kitchen. Um, so let's save again. So yeah, let's take care of here. Okay, if I can just lure this guy over here. Take him out and then I can take him out. So 
So that's a nice mini pile of kitchen stuff. Who shall we take care of next? So there's this guy here. Try and lure him over into this part of the kitchen. Yeah, it's gonna be a fucking nightmare trying to get rid of people in the restaurant. Because you got a bit of cover here, but then it's going to be dragging their bodies across that's the problem. So I'm just going to try and lure him over here. He didn't hear that, apparently. Will he hear this? Oh no. I think this guy really is deaf. Oh no! Is he moving to investigate? Oh, maybe I could poison him? Does he taste that? He does taste it. Okay. Uh, I have rat poison. This might be a good way of taking care of him. So, as we're waiting for him, let's deal with this guy. I really hope that guard doesn't look around. Okay. The chef is tasting the soup or whatever it is he's cooking. So he'll be in here soon. Oh shit. More people. Well, I'm gonna have to deal with you. And quickly. Wait, the chef's going to a completely different bathroom? Oh no. This is a disaster. I guess that worked out okay. So we don't have the chef here. So there's a guy who's on patrol here. I'd quite like to get rid of him. Not sure how easy that will be. I don't know if we'll be able to drag his body because then she'll see it. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to save here and I'll try it. She might just be too far away to see. But I think she will see it. Yeah, I called it. I really hope saving there wasn't a massive mistake. It's okay though, I seem to have an auto save from a minute before. So, Oh, the guard as well. Uh, well, this is tricky. I'm quite hopeful nobody's going to see that body though. If I just leave him there. See, the problem is just remembering where I've left all of these bodies. Alright, so now he's moving away. That is so I'll try and take sir. care of this guy. There's also the people outside there, the gardeners and the guards. I'm a little nervous about them seeing me. But you know what, let's just try and lure that guy into the bathroom. He's coming straight into the bathroom? Right, that is weird. Drinks, what are you, 46, 48? Ha! Well, that was pretty convenient, all things considered. Uh, what now? What now? I'll just try and lure these people over to the bathroom, I guess. Uh, what happened to my knife? There it is. I didn't say anything, got nothing. Yeah, I had. <laughs> Stop throwing things, you could hit someone smack right in the head, you know? Uh, where did the knife go? Did it ping off into the ether? That was nothing, Pete. Oh, whatever. That was not a good place to do that, but... I think we're getting away with it. That guard is making me pretty nervous. Hey, Mr. Brick. I hope at the end of all of this I can find a brick and take out the brick with a brick. Also, I've thought about how am I going to separate these two? I think the simplest way would be to poison the brick. I know that I can poison the guard. 
he's got a bottle of water out um, over in the patio, but but he doesn't go to the bathroom to throw up, but he just throws up in a bin that's like right next to where they are. So that's kind of no good. I could poison the brick, but the thing is at this point in the game there's no telling which one of these dishes he's going to eat when he comes past here and indeed sometimes he comes past there and he doesn't eat any of them and I don't think there's enough rat poison in the map to poison all of them and still have some left over to take care of some other NPCs so I don't know I might be shit out of luck there but hopefully there's something I can do I don't think I can do the trick that I did with the manager and her guard because I believe if I get all up in the bodyguard's shit then he becomes suspicious. I suppose I could test that theory but not right now. Uh, we've still got some people to take care of in the restaurant. So her first. Okay, well, that was a load of nothing. Or was it? Oh god, that's stuck behind there now. Uh, come a little bit closer. Oh, fuck you then! Right, I'll try and get that knife back. It might be permanently stuck down there. I do have another idea, actually. It's probably a very bad idea. Oh, I didn't realise there was a an R and an S. Interesting. Um, this might be a really bad idea. Maybe I can get it now. Yes, crisis averted. Well, oh, actually, I wonder if it's possible to distract this guy. Will the brick follow him? Affirmativo. Affirmativo. Arrivederci. What? My god. Wait, the gardener is coming? What? Oh, that is bizarre. Probably just my imagination. Was that also your imagination? Attempt number two. Will you hear this? No, you won't. Uh, oh, no, you will. Uh huh. Uh -huh. God damn it. Attempt number three. Never mind. Oh my god, what the fuck? Why is she doing that? Here's the thing, would it be possible to just lure her to about here and then knock her out? Is anybody gonna see that? Oh, here comes the fucking brick. Right, I've got an idea about this guy. This could really backfire, but let's see. Hello? Sir, I would strongly advise Yep, I knew somebody would see that. Oh yeah, should also test out my theory that standing in front of him is no good. If I just do this. Yep. Hey, that happens. You look like you've done some oh god, this is gonna be a nightmare, isn't it? Try doing the double distraction again. One more time, just to make sure. No, it wasn't a false alarm. Come back. Sir, stop acting that way, or I'll have to take action. What, like ignoring everything? Come on. Okay, he's going for it this time. 
I'll give you one warning and then I will take action. I'm sure you will. Awesome. Right, the brick is now without a guard. I didn't think I was going to get the guard, but uh, here we are. Somehow that was easier than luring some random fucking woman. Shall we try this again? Tell you what, I'm actually quite hopeful that I'll be able to just knock her out here and nobody will see it. So weird. Shit. Who saw it though? That guy? Fuck you. Come on. Aha! Progress. Right, I'll try and lure her out here. Oh, he's coming? Show yourself, you coward. You coward. I've got nothing here. I couldn't see anything out of the ordinary. False alarm there. Hopefully I can get her now. Oh god, yeah, now okay. he's coming. I'll take All it, I right, suppose. Come on. Now the brick is coming? Okay. Back to work, but no, like people. I said, I definitely want to take him out with a brick if possible. So I'm just gonna let him get back to his business. Right, let's try this again. Oh, fuck off, Brick. Ooh. I didn't notice this fire extinguisher before. Alright, come on. You heard it too, right? Uh -huh. Oh, fuck off. Is some other completely random NPC coming to see it or not? I guess not. Uh, okay, maybe the best approach would actually be something more like this. Maybe I can lure them into the kitchen. This seems to be working. And of course you didn't hear that. Fuck! Come back here! Wait, is she now just standing there having a conversation with nobody? Oh my god, she is! <laughs> oh, this fucking game is wonderful. Right, okay. Enough talking to ghosts. Uh, let's try and get you out here now. Okay, someone is playing with us. Of course you didn't hear that, fuck's sake. I'm going back to your conversation with nobody. Let's try that again. Bring you here. Bring you here. Never mind. And then bring you here. Um. Oh, come on! Come the fuck on! Oh, and the brick is back. Oh, he's coming? Huh? I mean, I'll take it. That is just extremely unexpected, though. Okay, so now in the restaurant, we will have not that many people, right? Because the guard is gone. So it's just these two. Right, I really doubt that I'll get away with just knocking her out. You're so safe around guys like you. <laughs> you really shouldn't. Is anybody going to notice this? Yep. 
Thing is, who even noticed that? Was it her? What happens if I just try and take her out? <laughs> Nothing. Okay. Maybe now I can take her out? No, who's noticing it? That guy? Really? Maybe if I stand a little bit further back he won't notice it? He's got a really long line of sight then, if, if it really was him that spotted me. Right, I should be good. I'll let him walk past. Yeah, there shouldn't be anybody that'll see this. Bingo! Now, what to do with these bodies? It should be fairly simple to just drag her over this way. I'm worried about him seeing this though. Who noticed it? Oh, the brick! The fucking brick! God damn it! <sighs> okay. Boom. If I'm just quick about it, he won't be back here by the time I've taken care of her. Oh, the gardener's gonna see. Shit. Hmm. I don't really have much choice, I just gotta try and drag her across here. Ooh. But I don't have a lot of time before the brick comes back, so I'm gonna have to just leave her there. He's coming. I reckon he's gonna see this body. I might have to just... Oh wait, maybe he won't. Let's just... Wait and see. What do we have here? Nothing. Oh, right. I will move her just a little bit. Right. Drop her there. Definitely won't be able to see her. There is no reason to be alarmed, sir. Nothing is happening. Oh my god. Right, that's the restaurant cleared then. Fucking hell. I mean, that was pretty bad, but not as bad as I was expecting it to be. Right. So that's it. And um, yeah, so now I should have a pretty good opportunity to drag this body over with the rest of them. Whew. Right, let's save the game again. I might call that the end of episode two. And episode three. Ooh, I'm not sure. Maybe the lobby? Is that a bit too ambitious? I'll just... I'll do a, a little look around to decide. Shouldn't be too difficult to get that guard over here. Yeah, okay, I think I will try and take care of the lobby in the next episode. But yeah, we've cleared out the ground floor restaurant. Um, it shouldn't take a lot of work to get rid of everybody outside at least in this like quadrant Security, huh? if, if i see anything rest assured i will let you know uh, yeah i'm not sure what i'm going to do in the next episode but um i'm calling it there for this one unfortunately i do not feel confident about dragging all of the bodies that we've taken out up into the suite just now but if i can clear the lobby then certainly I can get all of the uh, bodies that are in the kitchen there, upstairs, and possibly the ones in the bathroom as well. So yeah, um, I'll catch you all in the next episode.